this video I'm going to show you guys how to enable Touch ID and how to use it. So here I have a MacBook Pro 2020 with the Touch Bar running OS Catalina. So if you go over to System Preference, you're going to see an option here for Touch ID. So you want to go ahead and click there. Then click on the plus sign here. And then it's going to ask you for your current MacBook Pro password. So you go ahead and enter the password. In here, what you're going to do is you're going to rest your finger and then lift it repeatedly. So go ahead and do that until the image here is completely red. And then once you finish that, it's going to give you a message that is ready and then you click done. If you want to add a second fingerprint, then you will click on the plus button again and then do another finger. And then from here, what you could do is you could enable the, the options that you could use Touch ID for, as you can see here. Now keep in mind that the first option is when the computer actually goes to sleep and that's the only way to actually log in with the Touch ID. But if you log out completely from this account or if you restart your computer, when you get to the login screen, it's not going to give you an option to activate Touch ID. It actually is going to tell you to enter your password to activate Touch ID. So it's just like the phone, when you restart the phone and and you want to log into the phone, it's going to ask you to enter your PIN or password, whatever you set up. So essentially, it's the same security features here for your MacBook. Again, I don't know why they did that, but you cannot log in if you log out or if you log in for the first time. Only when the computers go to sleep and then you lift your screen up and then when you see the login screen, you'll be able to use the Touch ID. All right, so that's essentially how you use the Touch ID feature. If you have any questions, leave your comment below and please subscribe.